All right. Sometimes I'm watching a lot of these videos and I'm seeing this. Do you see this line that is all over the place? I see some people using it and I don't know why. It can be useful, but it is much more of a distraction, I find, because it's another thing that your eye is focusing on. And I prefer to turn it off. Options. This is the range. This is what it is. Turn it down. Now you see this little string is even smaller. Now for heavy ships, I definitely find it's useful to have this because it's sometimes hard to tell which direction your inertia is traveling. And at least that arrow on the line kind of shows you. But for pretty much most, uh, pretty much all ships, I turn it off. Disable. There. Now all you're seeing is your vector and the target. And if you're using a mouse, I use a mouse like Hosam, joystick, and mouse. It's so fine tuned. I just find it so much easier without that line. And then we'll show you now with a larger ship. Okay, so now we're in the uh, Corsair with no line. Now, it's one thing to f fly the big ships, but you see how there's like this inertia. I'm going back and forth. Which way is the mouse? So that's why sometimes I'd like to have it on for ships with inertia. Definitely ones that are noticeable enough. Oh, one. So now I can at least see which way the inertia is traveling. And then for, uh, especially the Corsair, I always up straight, VTOL down, and I'm always swinging, trying to swing the back end around to the target. I Obviously, I don't want to shoot this thing. But I'm just trying to show you the line. This is when I find the line can be helpful. Maneuvering. Let's see, down strafe is not very good with the Corsair, but up. Especially if you boost. You can just whip right around. Anyways, I just wanted to see. I see a lot of uh, people playing and this line is so long and they're like chasing it back and forth. Back. See how you can use the line. Kind of slow. Okay. This is when I like it. Anything other than a, a heavy ship with inertia, I just don't bother with it. And it just so you guys remember, that was it's under your game settings. And then your uh, your VJoy, which is your mouse. I, I slide it all the way down. Like you see when you slide this all the way up. Now you're pulling the mouse so far over. Like I'm moving my mouse left, right, left, right. If you're using a mouse, this is a mouse and keyboard problem. But man, does it make a difference turning that down. And then on the small fighters, like definitely have that, like turn that off. 
and disable on small ships. So I leave the settings always on the, that low setting to keep that little string as small as possible. And I usually only keep it on. And once I get really good, I eventually turn it off. Because it's another thing. I'm like, you see, like, you're looking at it, right? Like you can just see it. I can do all of what all the things you're seeing my that little cursor do. I can learn to do that without the line. I just find it very distracting. Anyways, just a quick tip. Thanks, guys.